Hey everyone, Michael Turner, your DBA Rebuild Task Force Chair and uh, up in the attic today. And I uh, want to talk to you a little bit about the uh, the new units that we're putting in, which are seal combustion units. Uh, seal combustion heating, uh, our furnaces on those. And um, easy way to tell that uh, if you're looking at, uh, at purchasing a house that, uh, you know, you're trying to wonder what kind of uh, systems they got on there. Obviously, if you're, if you're purchasing a house and you've got a foam encapsulated roof, you're going to have that. And, and the reason that we had to convert these to seal combustion. First off, they were 20 something years old. It was time to upgrade them. Uh, but we're going with a foam encapsulated attic. So all this area along the top of this roof line will be sprayed foam. So what we're gonna do is create a giant cooler for this building. So all the duct work now is run inside of air conditioned space. Gonna make everything a lot more uh, energy efficient. But uh, a quick way to tell if you're looking at a furnished unit, whether it's sealed combustion or open combustion is these PVC pipes right here. So the PVC pipes, uh, we've got one that comes through right here that is an air intake, and this other one at the bottom uh, comes through here is an exhaust pipe. Um, and the way that uh, these systems work right here is there's a door that goes over top of this that seals any kind of air on an, on an open uh, aspirated system. You've got these little louvers where it draws in air from, uh, from this attic space. Well, the way these work is we've got a double wall pipe that goes up through the, uh, through the attic. So double wall right here, then it splits into two pipes. Uh, this pipe right here is the intake, so it draws the air inside of here. Well, here's your burners right here, so feeds the uh, air into here so that it can make combustion, and then it, what it does is it's making heat through here. The little bit of heat that is lost, these are these are 94% efficient. Um, so that 6% of, of loss goes right here and exhaust back out to the, uh, to the outside. So super energy efficient uh, units right here. The uh, blower in this thing right here is what they call an ECM motor. So um, electronically controlled, it'll ramp up and down based on what the heating and cooling needs are. Uh, and the great thing about these things is in the, uh, you know, in the summertime, these things will run in a very low speed uh, based on what your humidity settings are, pull extra moisture uh, out of the air uh, and keep the building feeling uh, very comfortable at a higher temperature uh, than what you would get without these, uh, these variable speed motors. So super excited about this. Everybody that, uh, that are watching these videos, that uh, is a uh, building geek is going to enjoy this stuff. And uh, so super excited about this and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.